Hello friends, this is Vijay Gautam. In this tutorial, we are going to discuss about temporary table in Excel server. So now let's get started. So what is temporary table? Temporary table is nothing more. It is a just table like similar to our permanent table that is available in our SQL server or SQL. So there are some funds up there. So I am going to discuss. SQL Server provides the concept of temporary table which help, helps the developers in a great way. It provides workspace to the user. And uh, second point is these tables can be created at runtime. time. And uh, another point is these tables can do all the kinds of operations that one normal table can do. These tab tables are created in second TV database so why we need this temporary table actually it is provide the workspace to the user so suppose it is actually it is the very most important concept available in sql server with the help of this uh, temporary table we can do any anything operation suppose if we want to check our data inserted or not in the original table so if we want to perform some operation in our original table so if suppose if i want to modify some data or delete some data so if i am doing some work in our original table so suppose our data is deleted permanently and dropped permanently so how we will get the data so that's why we are not directly performing operation in the our permanent table so we need to use temporary table so that's why we use temporary table in our SQL Server. So now I am going to uh, discuss about this table with the help of pra example practically. So I want to show you in SQL Server there are two types of temporary table. First one is local temporary table and second one is global temporary table. So the syntax is similar to our permanent table but there is only one difference that is only has. We will prefix with has before the table name. So now I am going to create this table. So and you can see this point. This table can do all the kinds of operations that one can, one normal table can do. And these tables are created inside temp TV. So we can see here in system database. Here this is my database. Inside this we will get system database. Now in temp db we will not have any table in temp db now temporary table there is no temp there is no temp table available so now i am going to create this table so after creating this table it will store in temp db now we can see first refresh this database now we can see temporary table now college here i will be i have created this table college now we can see table is created so this table is created okay don't worry about this one okay our table is created so this is the syntax similar to our permanent table so the and one more table is there that is global temporary table so the global temporary table also is the same as our local temporary table but only there is difference only one that is here I am using two has okay but in local temporary table I am using only one has so the, this is the syntax differences so now I am just copy and paste this and similar to our permanent table so just copy and paste this in SQL server now we can see our now I have only one college table, so now this is my global temporary table. So I am going to create just select and press F5. So commands completed su successfully. Now refresh this MPV, and we can see here in temporary table folder, we can see college table and DEPT. So okay, this is my DEPT table. So this is DEPT table, this is college table. So and this we uh, i already told you the table this is uh, temporary table are 
also similar to the our permanent error. So it is it can contain um, the constants and anything. So and this this table can perform any operations. So now the differences. In the next video, I will discuss about the temporary differences between local temporary table and global temporary table. So thank you for watching this video. For more videos, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. Here has PK button. Thank you.